In picking the perfect campground, there's so much to choose from. There's sort of two types of campgrounds. First are the private campgrounds. Each province and state has a campground association that produces a directory once a year. That's available free. They have websites that you can visit and order these directories online. And as you're traveling, you can gather them as you travel. In these directories, they've often got good indexes where you can, at a glance, figure out whether they have a lot of overnight sites, what kind of full service sites they have so that if you stop at a certain time of day you may have two or three campgrounds to choose from you can at a glance pick the campground that suits you the best. A lot of these campgrounds will have what we call overflow areas so that in the event that they are busy and their sites happen to be booked they've got an overflow area where you can park your RV and not have to travel around looking for another site. Especially that's an advantage if you are self-contained. The other group of campgrounds are provincial or the national parks some of the most beautiful and breathtaking scenery, but some of the more popular parks and ones that you usually have to book in advance. Sometimes you're on a vacation where you just want to drive a little bit later into the evening, stop, park the RV, get something to eat, get a good night's sleep, get up in the morning and you're off again. It's nice to get into a campground, enjoy it, swimming pools, the kids can run around, you get playgrounds. Uh, you also want to look at different amenities like horseback riding or sports for kids to play. They got, uh, you know, basketball, volleyball, lots of things to consider when you pick the campground. So there's lots to choose from. Take a look at the experience that you want to have and pick the campground that suits you the best.